Hi, this is Grace Pamela with summerana.com, and this is the preview tutorial on how to use our firework overlays. And these are available at summerana.com. So here we go. I'm going to show you two images. One image I'm going to show you how to apply these firework overlays. Uh, you can also add nightshade and firework night. I'll show you what those do really quick. So you can see here it will add more darkness and more of a nightshade to your image and to erase it off of your subject or any way you like all you need is the soft black paintbrush and I like to put it at about 30% or so just so it looks more realistic as you're erasing off the subject And you can also adjust the opacity to however dark or light you want it. You can also add Firework Night, which will basically give your image more depth. And again, you can erase it off the subject if it's too harsh or anywhere on your image. And adjust the opacity. Next you can apply your firework by pressing apply firework overlay and pressing play. And here are some fireworks you can add. Press place. You can resize it by holding down the shift key and resizing it or you can select the link up here and that will hold the perspective for you. Press the check mark. Press continue. And you can move it around however you like. You also have resizer and rotator actions and if you change the perspective and press play and press continue, you can pull out or in or however you like and change the perspective of your firework. So if you want it up more, however you like. I'm going to go ahead and apply another one. Press continue. Place. If you need to erase it off of your subject, like let's say it say I wanted it right here and it's kind of in her hair. Again, just choose a soft black paintbrush or a harsh depending. So you can choose a hard paintbrush. Opacity at 100. Make sure you're painting in the white layer mask. And then erase it. If you make a mistake, choose a white paintbrush and you can paint it back. actually kind of like it over here. And there you go. You can also add different effects. Uh, simmer down, shine a little brighter. All you have to do is actually select your all you have to do is actually select your um, firework layer and then press play. And then you can adjust the opacity of it to shine a little brighter or darker or add a little more color or you can change the color of it a little bit add a tint um, you can also add warm firework glow or cool this is just so it's not going to be attached to your clipping mask here so press continue and you can adjust the opacity Also, blur your fireworks. If your background is blurry, it might not look so realistic if it wasn't blurred also. Um, and also black and white. And then I'm also going to show you how to add a reflection and 
if you want to save here I added multiple fireworks to create this firework show kind of like a finale and if you want to do that um, all you got to do is apply them and then um, if you want to save them all you need to do is go to new file background color black press ok and then you can just merge your files so let's say let's say I wanted to create this firework show right here so I'm going to select my firework layer and press and hold down control on my keyboard you can also select any linked layers here if you have any shine a little brighter or simmer down or anything like that you want to make sure you also select those once you have all your layers selected that you'd like to merge right click and click merge layers and there you have your firework um, finale there so then what you're going to want to do once you have that drag it over to your new layer resize and rotate hold down your shift key size it however you like and then you're going to flatten and save and then once you save it you'll be able to select it from your fireworks so for example I'm going to apply, I already did this one, I already saved it and I put it down here press place, place it however you like press continue and there we go now I have my firework finale here and it's lots of fun to mix and match them all. Now, I'm going to show you really quick how to create a firework reflection. So you press play, press continue, and you select the same firework, only you put it down lower in your water or wherever you'd like your reflection to be. And then, uh, just a quick tip before you add that on, if you want to dodge some of your water reflections, it'll make it show brighter and it'll look a lot prettier. I already did a little dodge in here. It was really dark and murky when I go in here. There you go. Now once you have your um, reflection layer, choose a soft white paintbrush. You can just paint on your reflection here. Now it doesn't have to be perfect at first. Choose a soft black paintbrush. Lower the opacity. And you can kind of blend it in a lot better. However you see fit. Now I added one right here that I worked on. It's pretty much the same thing. And that's how you do it. So that was the preview and tutorial for the fireworks overlay and action collection from summerada.com. Thank you so much for watching.